All right. I finally got my first light Century 2.0 jacket and bib. And I'm just gonna do a first impression of what I like and I don't like about both of them. Um, I haven't taken them hunting. I'm not gonna go over all the features, the grams and all that because there's a million videos of that already. So let's get into it. All right, on the jacket, what I like. First off, I love all the pockets. Pocket, pocket, pocket right here pocket on the inside i love all the pockets i'm a pocket type person and on the inside of these pockets there's a little cuff right here so that it traps heat i really like that um the zippers are really quiet i think zippers are uh hugely underrated underrated on garments i think a really good zipper takes it to another level um i also like how easy it is to adjust the hood and the waistband River, river, oh yeah, these are on the inside. I also really like how this is hidden away, nothing to snag on it. And then also how easy it is to just press the button to loosen it and on all hoods. I also like the cuffs on the arms, stretchy so you can have your, your release, your wrist release. And then of course the harness right here absolutely key what i dislike about the garment about this jacket is how high this collar is this is a really high collar i don't really like collars in general but this is high it goes all the way up to my nose so i'm gonna have to just kind of adjust it kind of tuck it in like that and then the other thing and i'm not sure if this is a dislike or not but the bulkiness of it it's more bulky than what i'm used to but it's gonna keep you warm, so I guess it's a catch-22. Um, the other thing I, I'm not sure if I'm a fan of is the kit link. It's a huge zipper, and I think once you open it, a bunch of your heat's gonna go out. Um, but that's about it. So for the bib here, what I like about it is, first off, the adjustable waistbands here. You don't need to wear a belt. I love how it has full leg zippers. Absolutely love the pockets here. You got this little pocket, you got a zipper pocket, and both are on the thighs on the front. So when you sit, whether in a saddle or in a tree stand, you have access to all that. I like quality, um, the quality suspenders, really easy to use. And then of course the fly, really like that. Um, I, there's not much to dislike, or I guess still, I should talk about the fit. The fit for this one I really like because it's tighter, it's more athletic, um, and also the length of it. Usually bibs are, I have about a foot left of fabric. This one, I probably have half a foot maybe, um, but the fit is, it's manageable compared to other bibs, so I really like that. Um, but other than that, I really like it. Again, the bulkiness of it, but I'm sure I'll get used to it. Um, Fitting-wise, I am, I'm 5'3", 160 pounds, and this bib fits fits right on. I can still do some layering underneath. In contrast of the, the jacket, I layered it with uh, their 150 and their 350 Henley, and then also the, what's it called, the Solitude Insulated Vest. And I, I was still able to move and be mobile and all that too, so um, you can layer under this. Again, I'm 5'3", 160. I got both of these in medium. Um, the uh, only, I guess the overall con, in my opinion, is these are very expensive. But other than that, I like them. I can't wait to use them. All right, so that was my quick no BS initial thoughts on the First Light Sanctuary 2.0 outfit. Hopefully you enjoyed it and good luck on this upcoming season.